Top of the time zone, everybody. This is Freddie J here with Freddie J Sports. We are back at it again, playing some NASCAR 06 Total Team Control Fight to the Top Mode, but it's 2023. We previously last left off uh, struggling a lot. A lot in the Craftsman Truck Series. We're dominating in the Wheel and Modified Tour, but our next event coming up is none other than the UPS racetrack here for the log cabin 200 and uh we're gonna qualify for this also next up is more ups for the wheel of modified tour and then we're also gonna get the irp y'all like this kind of content make sure y'all like comment and subscribe because we're gonna be at it again hopefully soon doing some more of this i really enjoy this series because i when i was younger I wasn't able to play this like how I wanted to. Now that I'm older, I'm actually smarter, I think, compared to how I was before when I was like a little baby. I didn't understand how games work. So without further ado, let's go ahead and qualify, get it away. And yeah, so one of the biggest things about this series um, that I'm struggling with is one of the things I feel like what I didn't do was... Because I auto simulated to 2023, like I started in 2005 and then I just sent to 2023, and I didn't actually. Let's see. I was still getting money. I still had a contract with the Wheel Modified. I just didn't race, and I was getting. I was still getting a million dollars. Like I think my total right now is two million. Like, I could buy a team if I wanted to, but I didn't. Actually, I actually did. I bought the Evernham contract. I bought that team to buy the 19 car for the Wheel of Modified. So that way, I could max out the settings. So that way, when I sold the team and signed a contract to that same team, I would just dominate with that car. That's how I was able to get through that. I wasn't expecting to be able to get a Craftsman Truck Series contract. But I, I didn't buy the team that I was going to sign the contract to upgrade the car that I was using. So that's why I'm struggling. But we did get a couple wins. I think we got one a few top fives and tens. We're also struggling because we started the season late, so we're at the back of the point system. But that's not going to matter because we're going to do great here. Here with our Bob's Wire Fencing 103 car. This reminds me a little bit of Bristol. A little bit tighter. A little bit slower. Alright, so I didn't do a good job qualifying there. We're going to be on the outside, so that is not what we want. Yeah, that's going to be fun. I'm just going to keep the car as is. That is for sure. There's no way I'm going to trust myself to go for broke on that one. How do y'all like the faceless commentary on these vids? I, I mean, I can't go face cam here, but I kind of feel like they would kind of distract you from the gameplay. Like, I like to be able to commentate on it, but at the same time, I don't know. People enjoy this kind of, kind of videos, but at the same time, I also want to kind of feel a little bit personal. But again, 
if you comment, I'll be able to, you know, read your feedback and see what to go from there. But I like the way the gameplay is set up. Just able to get this in 1080p. I mean, granted, it's a 4-3 ratio, but you get the 1080p, uh, get the 60 frames. It looks a lot better than how it would on the place on my PlayStation, that's for sure. Also, the next Hill Cup is at Watkins Glen, but we have the ability to sign autographs, so let's go ahead and do that. Talk about some real quick time games. Square, triangle, cross, triangle, 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 cross, circle, triangle. Oh my gosh. I missed one autograph. Man. Also, my tongue hurts for no reason. It's been hurting all day. I've actually been hurting since last night. I'm trying to figure out what's up with that. EA Sports and the UPS International Speedway welcome you to tonight's NASCAR Crossman Truck Series event. It's short track racing at its finest, and it's a perfect evening for the event. Who will win the race for the checkered flag? We're about to find out. All right, let's get it. Get down. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Alright, now we settle down. This car may be a little bit too tight. There we go. So I have to go mid to low. Or at least high, then go down low. I can't go all the way low, otherwise I'll drift back up. Alright. I'm doing better laps now. Oh my goodness. There we go. That's what we need. We need to share draft our buddies so that way they're not mad at me. There we go. Halfway out of fuel. Ooh, what a good slide. All right. Just got to ease up and down. Well, I'm going to rally. Whoa. I'm going to go ahead and... Yeah, let's do it. All right, we're going to go full tires, drop down some wedge, and let's hope we'll be able to get back up there. Oh, why'd you fail? Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. 
I'm surprised there wasn't a caution from when that. Whoa. <laughs> Gracious, everybody's wrecking out here. There we go. Whoa. That was a big wreck. Got four to go. I think he's doing a little bit more than blocking. Well, that didn't work out for anybody. Come on. That was scary. I don't like how this thing's working with me, but we're going to get a top 20 finish, that's for sure. My goodness. Please let me go. A little bump and run, but we finish inside the top 15. I'm okay with that. So more of the story is probably pit with the leaders. Yeah, that's definitely it. Pit with the leaders, y'all. Oh, I don't need this. Let's look at the highlight reel. Good gracious. They were just swinging out our door. And this is the last one. Why do they have terrible highlight reels? Anyway. Dude's a little bit sad, but we're a villain now. A little bit of villain points there. <laughs> Dude is mad. I don't know what that guy's mad about. <laughs> That's what happens in short track racing, honestly, so I wouldn't put it past you. I just realized I don't have a pause button up here, so uh looks like it's gonna be uncut action. No, I'm going to confront him because, you, like, uh, listen, I've been through this whole mumbo-jumbo before. Shout out to Jeremy Mayfield for winning the Bush Series race. Jimmy Johnson winning at the Glen. So, yeah, seven wins, nine top fives and tens. I think we might run away with this one. I could like I literally took a break off of racing some wheel of modified tours and I was still good. So use that information as you will. EA Sports yeah. and the UPS International Speedway welcome you to the running of the Hoosier 100. Hoosier! The the line today is these NASCAR wheel of modified series drivers get ready to take on this great short track. Many NASCAR uh, we we don't care. I'm gonna go. I, I'll even start this race from the back. Well, terrible restart, but here we go. 
Eight laps. Look at this. Look at this. Already up to 17th, passing five cars. About to pass my teammate. Just get him out the way. A little bump and run. Look at that, already in 11th. Ooh, looks like our rival's up there. Rewind a little bit, going on the inside again. Ooh, collected both of them. Five to go. Look at this. Oh, buddy's a bit mad after that. Look at this. Contact, and we took the lead. Just like that. This is a like a filler episode because nothing's really going on here. Meanwhile, there's a wreckage back up there. So they're kind of piled up. But uh, that doesn't matter because I got clean air. No, nobody to hit me. This was a fast race right here. I don't know why they're telling me I'm halfway out of fuel as if I can pit. They're, like, you go into pits, you, there, there's nothing you could do. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. We take the whole course backwards. Look at the crowd going wild. Yeah, you get the point. That race was too fast to do it a a big celebration there. Look at the high right middle. Look at it zooming. Oh, never mind. Look at us, still zooming. We got the lead, and we took it. Bye. Bye. That's really all it was. Point of view, you're a car. Okay, you get the point. Honestly, I'm doing that so that way I can get some thumbnails for the for the video. Honestly, because thumbnails are important. Shout out to thumbnails. Got my hero points. Got 20,000 fans. 21,251, if I remember correctly, from uh, us looking at the screen for like two seconds. Got an email. Elliot Shatler wants a showdown. I've noticed you've been getting pretty popular. A head-to-head -head race would be great PR for both of us. I hope to see you out on the track. Hmm. Well, since I don't have a Sprint Cup car, a Nextel Cup car, listen, I was about the auto sim instead of going to here. Uh, we're going to IRP. That's Indianapolis but the oval instead of the oval the other oval wait no infineon raceway park no that would be just infineon we'll find out when we get there Like, honestly, it's either a road course, which, uh, it's either a road course or the other oval. It's either the road course in California, 
No, because I think they would call it Sonoma. But I, I've heard it be called Sonoma, Son Sonoma or Infineon. So we'll, we'll find out when we get there. I know someone's already like... Oh, yep, it's the Oval. Okay. Indianapolis Raceway Park. Yep. I was right. So this is the other, because there's the Brickyard, and then this is the track where the other uh, um, the other series go to. Which should be, like, nearby. This is definitely a racetrack I could possibly win. If I just focus enough and believe in myself, I can do it. Look at this. I'm on the pole. That's exiting turn two. Now look at us in turn three. Exiting turn four. That's it. We're done. We're done. We got the pole. Next. Looks like we're going to do two Craftsman Truck Series races. We'll, we'll finish off with the showdown. We'll finish off with the showdown. See, we're 21 minutes in. Wasting no time here. We didn't even look at the standings, which honestly, we don't need to really look at the sandwich. We probably moved up 100 points, but still 34 from the standings. I know we didn't look at the standings in the beginning of the video, but I looked it up beforehand. And so, yeah. Yeah, we only got one win, one top five, three top tens. So... I know that one probably came from Daytona, something like that. Daytona, for sure. Do we race Talladega in the truck series? I would love to see us run Talladega in the We're truck here series. At Indianapolis Raceway Park in the great state of Indiana for NASCAR Crossman Truck Series action. EA Sports is proud to bring you tonight's event as we get set for short track racing under the lights. We're in for quite a show, and these 36 NASCAR drivers are strapped in and ready to get things rolling. Is Indiana really that great, though? Here we go, on the pole. Green flag. Bye. I'm gonna lead the first lap. Whoa, that was a big hit. I heard that behind me. Comes in number six. Not gonna get it there. I will lead the first lap. Thank you. Five bonus points for leading the lap and I'm trying to take off with 15 laps to go the number 6 is hounding me right now where is that guy going oh number 6 dropped back here comes the 92 oh I scraped the wall gotta dive back in on the inside I gotta protect this lead because I need a win under my belt. It's bad. I'm three tenths of a second ahead, now down to two. It's getting real close. Oh no, they're back on my bumper again. I'm going down too low, almost hitting the apron here, but uh, looks like I gained some ground with that one. Now it's back up to four tenths. I don't want to switch yet until I can gain up a second. As we're halfway out of fuel, I might also change just to swap cars as long as uh, nothing happens to my driver while I do that. Uh, looks like there's a new second place driver. Ten to go. Oh, looks like the number six is coming back up. Moving up the third now.
Now fighting for second. Meanwhile, I'm just trying to hang on to this lead. Gonna try to move up here. A few of the people in the pack are pitting. A little bump and run right there. Moved up the ninth. Whoa. Protect this lead a little bit. And nobody else is pitting. Alright, let me save some gas then if we're running on fumes. We're making great ground. Five more to go. Ah, uh, just in time. No, not the 123. That was a half spin right there. It was the 121's fault, though. Just punted the 1 in 23 a little bit. Man. Yeah, I'll go pit. <laughs> I let my laps. I did my job. Do half a can. Fix the damage and be in and out. I'm pretty sure I lapped the entire field while I was out there, but that's okay. Here's the pace car. Let's go. I'm at least going to get second. Whoa! Dang. That is crazy. Well, at least we got a top five. I screwed myself out of that pitch strategy by leaving him out there. If we had that caution and I, I just stayed with my driver, we probably got it. But, you know, a top five is going to still do us tremendously good. Let's look at the highlight reel, pretending that it's us. It's not a lot of cut angles here, but it's whatever.
We'll take it. Now in victory lane. Oh, we're not in victory lane? I thought our, our homie won. I guess they won't give us the, hey, we came down to victory lane to help celebrate our guy. Guess I wasn't cool enough. Moving on. We're going to get a... Oh, we got a phone call. Check it out. I got a test chest to schedule for Courtesy Coil Chevrolet on Tuesday of week 28th. You'll be shooting for a... A, a, a Bush Series contract? Whoa. Looks like things are about to get interesting for our next episode of Fight to the Top Mode in 2023. Let's see about the phone. Hey, great work on that prestige there, big dog. You are really starting to become one of the powerful figures in the garage area. Now, whatever it is you're doing, it's working, so keep it up. Hey, thank you, Ace Moneymaker. And now, for the moment we've been waiting for, the main event. But before we get to that, let's check out the standings real quick. Alright, so as you can see here, we're nowhere in the top 10, the top 20. Oh, there we go. We finally cracked the top 30. Now we're just, uh, what's that, less than 20 points away from the 28th, another 20 from 27th. Now we're in fighting chance now if we can keep our nose clean. The next big gap is from 10th to 11th. Actually, let's look at it again. Yeah, that's pr our next big gap. So, we have our work cut out for us. Let's go ahead and get going. Ryan Newman wanting the GFS Marketplace 400. Congratulations. You want a cookie? Sure, bud. Chat, what's your favorite cookie? Not gonna lie, my favorite right now is uh, white chocolate macadamia nut cookies. Or if you have a sheets nearby you, the trash can cookie. The son of a trash can cookie as well. But the trash can cookie is like top tier. I can't explain it, but it's a mixture of a, a bunch of stuff and it looks ugly but it tastes amazing. So here we are at the Phoenix infield. I remember they took one of these tracks, one of these designs, to actually make this a uh, racetrack. Ooh, with the pedigree car. Too bad you're just gonna wreck. I like how every time I try to spin them out, they end up with a good position. But we're going to catch back up. At least we better. This is a good time for it. I will have to say that this car sucks, and that's the reason why we have to spin them out. But this is definitely going to be a preview of what's going to start our next run. With one lap to go, we'll see what happens on the next episode. But thank you so much as 
everybody for coming out. And as always, I'm Freddie J. Y'all have a good day and a better tomorrow. If y'all like this kind of content, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, we'll see ya.